Hey guys, Joanne here with Newegg TV. I'm here to do an overview on these NZXT Hale 82 series power supplies. These 650 watt, 750 watt, and 850 watt. I want to mention a couple things that apply to the Hale 82 series power supplies before getting into the box. NZXT does offer their less than three program, which covers the cost of two-way shipping in case you get a dead PSU in the mail. And it comes with a five-year warranty. It is also 80 plus bronze certified, which means at 20% load, you get 82% efficiency, 50% load, 85% efficiency, and at 100% load, you get 82% efficiency. And they use Japanese capacitors, which give you better reliability, and a couple more specs I'll go over when I get to the actual product. Before I get into the hardware specs, here's a look at the power charts for all three PSUs. They're all 12, uh, single 12 volt rails, and for the 650 watt at max power, you get 53 amp and 630 watts. At, for the 750 watts, you get 62 amp and 744 watts, and for 850 watts, you get 70, 70 amp and 840 watts. Here's a look at the power supply unit itself, and I'm only going to go over one of them since, aside from the cabling, they all look the same. So here we go. Uh, you, over here we have your modular connectors, they're all nicely labeled so you know where to plug everything in, your CPU, PCI Express, and your peripherals. On this side we have some ventilation holes, your power port and power on off switch, and on this side NZXT logo. One last thing, here we have your 120 millimeter two ball bearing low noise fan. Here's everything that's included in the box for the 650 watt power supply. Here's the PSU itself, and over here we have your user manual, mounting screws, power cord, and you get three SATA connectors, an additional three SATA, three Molex plugs, another three Molex plugs, and here we have your 8-pin CPU plug, two 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express connectors and you get another 2 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express plugs 4 plus 4 pin CPU plug and your 20 plus 4 pin main connector that plugs onto your motherboard and notice that these cables are sleeved and this is a partially modular power supply here's what comes in the box for the 750 watt power supply you get your mounting screws, a user manual, power cord, and your three SATA plugs, an additional three SATA, and another two SATA connectors. Three Molex, another three Molex plugs, your eight pin CPU plug, and your two six plus two pin PCI Express connectors. Now for the non-modular cabling, you get your 20 plus four pin main connector, and here we have your 4 plus 4 pin CPU plug, and two 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express connectors. Here's everything that comes in the box for the 850 watt power supply. We have your mounting screws, user manual, and power cord, just like the other three, and your 3 plus 3 plus 2 uh, SATA connectors, which make 8, your 6 Molex plugs, 8-pin uh, CPU connector, 2 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express connector and on the non-modular side they have included four additional uh, 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express plugs. Wow that is a lot. Uh, here we have your 4 plus 4 pin CPU plug and your 20 plus 4 pin main connector and by the way all three of these power supplies are SLI and Crossfire ready. That wraps up our overview on these NZXT Hale 82 series power supplies, the 650 watt, 750 watt, and 850 watt. I'm Joanne, and if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our New Egg YouTube channel. Thanks for watching New Egg TV, and we'll see you next time.